We are back home and doing Advent before we settle in to watch the movie. So day 15 and 16 for Nerdfelt. Uh, calendar is Mr. Vulcan and Cyber Companion. This one Cyber looks, Companion smells pretty yeah. good. Sounds like it smells pretty good. Totally does. 15 and 16 of the NYX calendar. Ooh. Another lip oil. Candy pop. Nice. I really like these lip oils. They're very, very good. The lipstick. It's a matte lipstick, but in a blue shade. Oh, wow. This is called Sorbet. Awesome. Now we're on day three and four of the Game of Thrones one. So first let's do the fun fact for three. What does it say, Marshall? Where does House Greyjoy rule? The Iron Islands. All right, let's see what number three is. Those are pretty cool. Do you like those? Mm -hmm. All right, number four, that's the weight. Well, the, there isn't one that's got... Oh, there it is. There you go. Which of Daenerys Targaryen's three dragons are the largest? What does it say? Drogon. Oh. I don't know if it's this one. I guess it is. Ooh. Lay it down. Hmm? Minerva, not the one that showed up in the new movie. <laughs> and Ginny. Did we already have a Ginny? I don't think so. There they are. Good Monday morning. I am off to work. And this week at work, we are doing a Secret Santa. So we do like a little present every day. So that'll be fun. And then today, a bunch of people from work are going to go see Grinchmas. Even though I already saw it yesterday. I think I'm going to go again. Um, on my face, I'm using the Too Faced Chocolate Bonbons. Which I still enjoy. But I'm not sure I'm going to keep it around anymore. Because I have so many other palettes that I like better. Um, on my lips, I'm using the NYX This Is Everything Lip Oil. And I got this... Um, in, in candy pop in the advent calendar um i like it but it's really sheer i should have put on lipstick and then put something over it but, um yeah i think i'm gonna try to get a little bit more footage of grinchmas um while i'm there today so uh, i can share that with you guys as well good morning <laughs> it's tuesday some day in december i don't even know what day it is um I'm about to go to work and I just wanted to share uh, what I'm doing on the eyes is the gingerbread palette from Too Faced and I'm really I've been digging this like gold and pink and brown look lately so I'm hoping to use this again um, maybe this weekend so I can do like a more of an intense look with this and then on the lips I'm using the Too Faced melted matte gingerbread and sugar cookie and I am wearing naked Um, I'm going to be going to work in probably like an hour and a half, but in the meantime, I'm going to be doing some artwork. Yeah. I'm getting closer to having the December stuff done. January. Yeah, January. See, I do it all in December. They don't just appear. So it's Tuesday afternoon and, uh, we went to Old Navy and we were just planning on getting pants for Corey. I needed pants. But it turned out I got a bunch of crap ton more stuff because I finally started carrying plus sizes in our Old Navy and I got 20% off with my Old Navy card and it was an amazing deal. And now we're at Panera to get dinner. Oh, I hear it. Next door. Next door to Old Navy. 
two awesome places right next to each other. We're just trying to get out of the mall area before it gets too crazy today, but we've been okay. Um, so at Panera, because I can't have a lot of sugar, I drink the, what did I say? Plum, Plum ginger, ginger hibiscus. hibiscus. And what did you get to drink? I got the blood, I mixed the blood orange lemonade with the agave lemonade. So then we have to go pick up some packages from the office and then we're coming home, right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Hi guys, it is still Tuesday. Um, I'm trying to get a little bit of work done, like real work. <laughs> um, and in between time I thought I would um, open some mail. I like to pre-open everything so it doesn't take forever. So this first card is from my friend Bethany. We also are doing an ornament swap, but I haven't gotten that. I just got the card. It says, have yourself a merry little Christmas. I really like that one. And then this one is from Nikki Kelly. She actually is a newer customer of mine. That's cute. It's got like dogs and cats on a little pyramid. Yeah, it's a sweet little message inside too, so I'm going to hang those up. Those are my cards. Um, let's do mail. The first thing is in this pretty silver package. It's from my friend Andrea. We did a little swap for palettes. I'm sending her a couple pretties for your face palettes and a Starbucks cup. No, but I'm sending you a Starbucks cup because um, she sent me a little Starbucks ornament, so I'm sending her one too. Anyway, so this is the Nightmare Nightingale Pretty Vulgar palette. I have didn't know initially if I wanted this one, but I think it came in like a boxy charm. I saw people get it, and I'm like, you know what? I need to try this again because the other one that I had was like just this really colorful one, and it was not for me. Like I just I it wasn't like super enjoyable. But I just really wanted to try this one because I feel like like this shimmery color right here is going to be great. So thank you, An Andrea, for sending me that to try. My next is from my friend Valerie. We did a little Funko swap. I got a hopper, which is awesome because I have um, a barb and I have... An 11 so now I needed a hopper for sure I love this I love this so much this is from pretties from your face that's my little pretties from your face package cuz I purchased she had like a highlighter sale and I was like need these so she sent me a little card all right the first thing I got is this cherry berry lip scrub um, originally I purchased it for Marshall but it didn't come in time for me to wrap it all, but he still might get this. Maybe later though, but I want cherry. Yum. I also ordered this skull. It's like a, a bath bomb. And it was imperfect. It was in her clearance. And it was like crackling a little bit in here. So I decided that I would just buy it because... Like, I never use the whole thing anyway. Mmm. Smells really good. Mmm, smells really good. Then it looks like she sent me some freebies. I got a vanilla massage bar, which I need that. And a Japanese grape candy soap. Oh, I love how this smells. It's so grape. Reminds me of our wannabe scent. Oh, so good. Mmm, yeah. All right, let's get down to the highlighters because I know y'all just can't wait to see those. These are the most amazing highlighters. I cannot wait. If you guys want to order anything from her shop, um, then I'll leave a code down below. You get 20% off and you get to use that on top of whatever sale she's having. So this first one, ooh, this is very similar. This is called Purple Rain. This is very similar to one that I have already, which is Jump in the Line. It was from the Beetlejuice collection, but that one right there. It has a little more silver in it. This one is a little more white. 
think I'm gonna run out of room. <laughs> it's that blush. That blush is gonna make me run out of room. And those, I, I'm gonna have to get another Z palette. Okay, in the meantime, I have this this Pretty for Your Face one. I'll just put the blush back in there. I had to put the sticker back on the bottom. This one is called Oogie's Kids. Look how big this is. I didn't realize it was this big when I got it. But Oogie's Kids. So this was from her Nightmare Before Christmas collection. I did not grab it the first time. See how much bigger that is from my other ones? <laughs> That's awesome. I'll swatch them in just a sec as soon as I unwrap them all. This one is called Rosie. It was on clearance. Isn't that gorgeous? Mm. Okay. So these are the three new ones I just got. Let me go ahead and swatch them for you. Oh, that's gorgeous. That rosy shade. That is gorgeous. Okay. So this one, the top, this one is Oogie's Kids Purple Rain and Rosy. Let me go ahead and swatch, um, jump in the line so you can see the difference between the two purples. It looks very similar, but there is a slight difference. This one is a definitely more silver, and this one is definitely more white. I love it. Especially that rosy one. Oh, that's going to be gorgeous. This is going to be kind of a longer... So, my Z palette is now full. Because I need to get another Z palette. I didn't get mail yesterday, so that's why there's so much of it. Um, Ipsy Glam Bag. Plus, so we just found out, I just got an email from Ipsy saying they, their first Glam Bag Plus, Glam Bag Plus, um, was having a, an actual bag. And it looks like this month we got a bag too. But from now on, we aren't getting a bag. Probably because they want to do, they said they want to have like higher quality stuff, I guess. So let's see what we got in here. So the first thing is Smith and Colt Book of Eyes Eyeshadow Quad. Never had anything from Smith and Colt. Ooh, the packaging is very high, high, high quality. All right, that's what it looks like. I think it's cool, to be honest. I don't know if I will really wear that but it looks cool. Ice Tears is the name of the... But I don't know, like the blue and silver... Uh, I'm having second thoughts. The blue and silver is really in right now, especially for the winter. I might just try doing something like that. This one is Vitamin C Brightening Booster from 111 Skin. That's awesome because I just got the e.l.f. Vitamin C and I was looking for another vitamin C so definitely we'll use that later on once I am done with my elf one next is Lancome Ooh. apparently you can use this on your eyes lip eyes lips and cheeks but it's Le Monochromatique in Haute Couture that is a gorgeous color I'd use that as a blush. Yeah, liking that. And Lancome. I don't think I've ever tried a Lancome brush. Also got these brushes. And Estee Lauder Pure Color Envy Sculpting Stick in the shade Never Enough, which is mm, probably going to be red, which is fine, but an Estee Lauder lipstick like these are really high end it's not as bad as I thought I'm not hating it <laughs> I'm not hating the color it's I really thought it was going to be redder but it's more coral and I can definitely deal with that so yes all right, let's see what this last thing is in here, the bag. Ooh, this is really pretty. So the bag is, oh my gosh, it's one of those. I've always wanted this in a pillow, but in a makeup bag, yes. Yes, sirree, Bob. 
can also be used as a clutch. Definitely, it is really, it's roomy. Like you can fit stuff in here. Oh, this would be like the perfect party clutch. How fun is that? I love it. This is great. This is great. This, this box, I am so glad that I switched over to this because with maybe the exception of the eyeshadow palette, which I'm still on the fence about, everything in here is awesome. And the last thing I have is a Bath and Body Works haul. They were having a $2.50 lotion. So I got some for stocking stuffers. I got Pretty as a Peach. I got a uh, Sparkling Limoncello. That's my husband's like, one of, my, one of his favorite scents. And Pear Berry, that's one of my favorite scents. Mary Cherry Cheer. Winterberry Wonder. Cucumber Melon. And Vanilla Bean Noel, which I just got in a candle, and it's like the amazingest scent ever. Um, that is all of my mail. So far too much stuff. Um, we're going to come back later tonight when Marshall gets home to do Advent, which we will have two days of Advent. It's Wednesday morning. This week is going by so slow. <sighs> On my face today, I decided to do something a little new. So I'm using these shadows that I got in the NYX Advent Calendar. So um, I basically used this shade, which is cookie cutter all over the lid. And then I used this shade, which is Candy Stash in the crease. And it's very, very light. But then I also had this. This was not from the advent calendar, but it's like a, it's a cream eyeliner, but I used it as a base. And it is in the shade HHCL101. I guess it's Palisade Paradise. So that's a really pretty color. And it worked fine. And I will see how that turns out later today I used the uh, Bare Minerals Gen Nude in Slay on my lips and then the highlight which you guys saw me unbox yesterday it's this one from Pretty's Premier Face called Rosie and it's a very beautiful glow oh look who's behind me <gasps> it's a Zeno you have my hair Let I play with your hair for just a moment I can't tell if that was you or him. That was me. <laughs> we have not been able to do Advent for a while. So we're now doing three days at a time. So this is the Nerd Felt one. We have Day 17, A Logical Woman. I'm guessing that's some kind of um, uh, Vulcan reference for Star Probably Trek. Probably to um, Nurse Chapel. Probably. Um, the ginger and cloves are super strong in this too. Chosen Slayer is one of my favorite ones ever. Probably my second favorite after um, Hamilty. And uh, Old Fudge has a lot of chocolate in it. I think this one's going to be really great as well. Mm. Now we're on the next calendar. Oh, I wondered. The shape of the door, I thought it was going to be a lip. Okay, and this is the... Yeah. It's called Slip. It's the NYX lingerie, lip lingerie. Here's another one in the color Peanut Brittle. And the kind is? It's a liquid sundae, it's liquid suede. Okay. Another eyeshadow, it looks like. It is Sweet Tooth. Oh, that's pretty. Mm -hmm. So I think we have to do five, six, and seven. Mm -hmm. Okay, so five is, wait. Five is the, yeah. who was the head of House Tyrell? I'm guessing it's that, that grandma Tyrell lady. Lady Oleana. Yep. Olena. 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 Oleana. Olena. Olena. 
In the game of socks, you push hard or you die. Winter's coming. coming. Obviously, yes. That's why you have socks. Mm-hmm. And what is this one? I can't see a star like that anywhere on here. I don't know. <laughs> uh. Uh. Oh, the stag. Do. This one. What castle did Stannis Barthion, uh, Baratheon occupy? Uh, no idea. Dragonstone. Oh, hey. Oh. Those are fun. Yeah. They're fun. And then this one, that's this one here. That, no? No. I don't know. Just do this one. Which kingdom does House Aaron control? I don't remember. It's the Vale. It's that one that has the castle way up high that has the hole that people fall down. Oh, right. See, it's been a long time since I've seen all of this, and I'm tired, and so I can't really answer the questions. <laughs> Marshall's having a hard time with the door. Yeah, just pull it from number six. Flan oh, the fish. Family duty honor. The fish. Oh, little Voldemort. Malfoy. Oh, Malfoy, okay. Getting down on the bottom row. Oh! Oh, it's Crookshanks. Yeah. Yay. I like the little Crookshanks. It's cute. And that is all, right? Mm -hmm. Well, we do that pretty quickly now that there's not so many of them, but... I... But... Um, yeah, I've worked till close the last few days, and they've been really rough. Um... It's just a lot of people being really stupid right before the holidays. Today I almost got hit by two cars on the way into work, and I was riding on the sidewalk. So, people, just because it's Christmas doesn't give you an excuse to kill people. Look both ways. Peace. Good morning. It is finally Thursday. <laughs> uh, this week is still dragging. Um, before we jump into what today is going to be like, let me tell you what I'm wearing in my look. Today I'm using the Just Peachy Mattes, which is one of my favorite palettes. I used this shade Peach Butter all over my lid. Then I used, I think it was Just Peachy in the crease and then I use that purple shade peach sangria in the outside and then that blue shade that you see is from the only Tarte palette that I own for eyes which is the Tarte what's that called again make believe in yourself and I just wanted like some gray because I want to start playing with these blues and grays that you can do with your eyes and so I'm using this shade mystic it's that gray you see up there um, and then I have to say this again, because I'm slightly obsessed with this highlighter. This Pretty For Your Face highlighter in rosy right here. Um, it's on clearance, which makes me sad because I legitimately love this highlighter. It's gorgeous. Um, I'm you're wearing it with the Papa Don't Peach Blush, and it is just such a nice glow. On my lips is the uh, one of the ones we got in the advent calendar, the NYX Lip Lingerie in Slip. I do like this color. It's very, like, neutral and muted. All right, let's talk about today. So today, I have my pseudo office holiday party slash Secret Santa reveal um, this afternoon. And I have an actual long day at work because my husband works later tonight so I'm going in a little later but that was a good thing because we have to go take Marshall to work because today we are having tornado warnings and torrential rain 
Um, so that's not a I'm thing. not biking. Go ahead. I, I'm not going to bike and all of that. Um, I, it was already raining on my way home from work last night, and I was not too happy about it. Yeah, my parents went to Epcot for Candlelight Processional to see some people sing in it. And she was, my mom was like, there's hardly anyone here because the rain is driving them away. And I was like, well, that's a good thing. But yeah, I'm pretty sure, pretty sure they're going to close down Volcano Bay today. They would have to oh, yeah. with this weather and that tornado. Yeah. They usually close down Volcano Bay for cold weather. And it was for a couple days last week mm -hmm. and this Monday, but then Tuesday and Wednesday were actually okay. But I bet you today they're going to close it down. On the plus side, I've gotten a lot of the artwork ready to go for next month's stuff, including our off-box scent. Um, I'm just waiting for the approval. It's got a lot of Easter eggs, 31 of them. Mm. So I'm really kind of excited about that one. Yes, so that's what's basically happening today. It's going to be a lot of driving around and mm -hmm. pick this person up, pick that person up from work and tonight I don't even know <laughs> I haven't really thought that far ahead it is advent time we had kind of a late night at work so we picked Marshall up uh, like I said this morning it was torrential downpours almost all day tornado warnings etc so Marshall did not bike to work needless to say and uh, so we picked him up from work, got some dinner, came home, did some work, and now we're at Advent. So Nerd Felt Tea is inconceivable for day 20. I love that name. Mm -hmm. This is a very disturbing door for this ginger. It looks like lips, right? Yeah. Well, and then I'm also looking at this one. Like, what is happening here? Piggyback mm -hmm. ride. Another eyeshadow. Mm-hmm. This is called Whipped Mocha. Ooh, it's a nice matte. I mm -hmm. like it. I'm digging these eyeshadows. Uh, eight. Which is, what is House Martel's motto? Which one is Martel? It's the it's this one. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Who is it? I don't remember the character that No, is. no, I mean, what uh, is the... Unbowed, unbent, unbroken. Okay. Basically, they don't surrender. Never never give up. Never surrender. Yeah. Comment below if you know that movie. And again, it's the crest of a completely different house as the sock. I have to say, of all of the... Funk, the uh, Advent mm -hmm. calendar, this is probably my favorite. Not just what's in it, but... How easy it is to open. Nearly had this nick. Oh, nice. Nearly had this. I love the ghosts, like the color of the ghosts. Mm -hmm. 